Today we are heading back into more AEW Universe mode here as we were coming off a very successful AEW Blood and Guts and now we are on the road to AEW All Out. So let us see what is gonna happen next here in this Universe mode. So post AEW Blood and Guts, we have two rivalries going right now. Lance Archer and Andrade. And we also have Proud and Powerful and the Gun Club. So I'm glad this is still going. Gun Club recently turned heel. Evil Gun Club, if you will. Colt Cabana has defeated Luther. Luther in the middle of a big push and Colt Cabana just put the bricks to that. Maki Ito beats Vaney. Christian Cage beats Adam Page. Lance Archer versus Andrade. Lance Archer wins. Something happened in this match. Proud and Powerful beat the Gun Club. Dustin Rhodes beat Miro. Okay, I think both the champions lost on this show. TNT champion Miro lost to Dustin Rhodes. Adam Page, the world's champion from Blood and Guts, ended up losing to Christian Cage. And Kenny Omega beat Pac in the triple threat here. Vaney could not defeat the AEW Women's World Champion Maki Ito. Christian Cage could defeat Adam Page. And Dustin Rhodes beat Miro. Okay, that shakes things up a little bit. Colton Gunn and Austin Gunn carried out a relentless assault on Ortiz and Santana. These superstars are bent on inflicting pain on their rivals and anyone else who gets in their way and shows no sign of stopping. I love that the gun club are the aggressors here. This is awesome. Miro defeats Sean Spears? Maki Ito is just dominating everybody currently. Defeating Amy Sakura. Adam Page beating Pac. Pac lost the triple threat last week too. Orange Cassidy getting protected here. Lance Archer defeated John Moxley. Proud and Powerful defeated the Gun Club again. Luther has beaten the Butcher. And Christian Cage beat Kenny Omega. Christian Cage might be getting the push of the top. Britt Baker sat down at ringside claiming she wanted to scout her rival. Her pretext was exposed after she distracted Maki Ito from her match and allowed her opponent to strike her from behind. She's put her rival on the losing end of these mind games, manipulating and frustrating her however she wants. Are we gonna run back Britt Baker and Maki Ito again? Hmm, not if I have anything to do about it. Coming out of a loss in tonight's match, Colton Gunn and Austin Gunn argued with each other over whose fault it was. <laughs> Will these superstars be able to resolve their issues and get back on the same page? Are we seeing the gun club explode right in front of our eyes? Beaver Boys defeat Proud and Powerful. For some reason, I think the Gun Club might have something to do with that one. Seems they got back on the same page here. We have Bryant. Wait, what happened here? The match changed. Sunny Kiss and John Moxley not in anymore. Brian Cage and Powerhouse Hobbs taking their spot and then defeating the Wingman. We'll see what happened in the news here in a minute. Andrade losing to Lance Archer. Yuka Sakazaki coming onto the scene and taking out the world's women's champion, Maki Ito. Adam Page beats Pac. Christian Cage beats Kenny Omega. And Miro beats Brody Lee. Colton and Austin Gunn have taken their rivalry to a personal level after attacking Ortiz and Santana. <laughs> Brian Cage and Powerhouse Hobbs force their way into Peter Avalon and Cesar Bononi's match by taking their opponents out of action with an ambush. So they attacked Sonny Kiss and John Moxley. These superstars couldn't wait to get another shot at them. This may be the first of many dangerous moves to come in the rivalry. Are you telling me we have Team Taz versus the Wingman? This might be the best feud of all time. The AEW Universe shouted their disapproval to Britt Baker after a display of disrespect towards her opponent and the crowd. Ah, so she must have something to do with the Yuka Sakazaki and Maki Ito match this past week. We got Proud and Powerful versus the Gun Club. It looks like the Gun Club won this one. Colt Cabana versus Cody. Cody beats Colt Cabana. Britt Baker versus Amy Sakura. Amy Sakura with a huge win. Amy Sakura defeating Britt Baker is massive. I'm sure Maki Ito had something to do with that though. Lance Archer and Andrade versus the Six Gods. Wow, Andrade. Pinned Chris Jericho. Adam Page versus John Moxley. Adam Page won. Kenny Omega versus Christian Cage one on one. Christian Cage beat him again. I think we made the right decision to move Christian Cage up. Sonny Kiss versus Miro, the TNT Championship on the line. Let's get into it. The biggest match of Sonny Kiss's career. Oh, and the reversal right off the start. TNT Championship on the line. Sonny Kiss goes for the pin early. Not even a one count. Off the ropes goes Miro. He comes back. Sunny Kiss drop down. Leapfrog maybe. No. Single leg kick drops Miro to a knee. Into the corner. Sunny Kiss with the handspring back elbow. Sunny Kiss. Last time we saw Sunny Kiss on Dynamite, I believe Sunny Kiss was getting attacked and taken out of a match by Team Taz. Oh no. Just tossing Sunny Kiss. Bulldog. 
courtesy of Dustin Rhodes right there. Sunny Kiss has been training with Dustin. Oh, wait for the ass cheek bomb. Sunny Kiss. Maybe looking for the handspring back elbow again. And does, but Miro just sends her to the ground. That's tough. And the Rusev kick. Ooh, baby. A little Machka action. That's rough. Uh-oh. That's not what you wanted to see. That's not, that's not right and not good. Oh, but Sunny Kiss reversed. And the speedball kicks from Sunny Kiss. Oh, it knocks Miro backwards. Oh, but the spear take down. Wow, I think Miro might actually be a little scared. TNT title reign might be coming to an end. Big reversal. Whoa, Rana from Sunny Kiss. Wait, what is this from Sunny Kiss? Oh my God, the splits. Is that a pin? Oh my God. Just a two. I thought that was it, man. Sunny Kiss going crazy. Big line from Sunny Kiss. Two big lines. Leg Lariat. Is that a comeback? Does Sunny Kiss have signature? What is this? Oh my god. Into the floor. The Spike Rana gimmick. Spike head scissors into the splits again. There's no way. There's no way. Oh, wow, wow, just before three. Miro fighting from the floor, big Rusev kick. I think that's it, I think that's it. No, just a two, you're gonna lock it in. I think that's exactly what Miro's got planned. No, but Sunny Kiss reversed. Did Sunny Kiss reverse the game over though is the question. Oh, and Rusev gets the upper hand. Stuff. Will a little bit of the machka be enough to take down Sunny Kiss? Oh! <laughs> no way! Oh, wait a minute. The game over! The game over! It's game over, man! It's game over, man! It's game over, man! Sunny Kiss taps out and Mira retains the TNT Championship. That's a huge match for Sunny Kiss. Even if Miro ended up getting the win here, Sunny Kiss showed out. Much deserved, Michael. I don't think his opponent is too happy about losing here. Yeah, probably not. Oh, look at oh look at Sunny Kiss. This is bullshit. That's why this damn company is a damn shame it is. Colton Gunn and Austin Gunn cemented their dominant victory with a vicious post match. <laughs> <laughs> they cannot stop getting their ass kicked by Colton and Austin Gunn. Britt Baker tried to leave her match in progress, only caring about her upcoming championship opportunity. The champion will put an end to her challenges and title attitude and force her to go through with her match with Amy Sakura anyways, as Maki Ito ran down to ringside and tossed her back in the ring. Kenny Omega beat Christian Cage this time. Britt Baker beat Maki Ito. Mm, rivalry match, something might've happened here. Let's check it out. Adam Page beat Orange Cassidy. Orange Cassidy finally taking that L. John Moxley beat Andrade. Cody beat Joey Janela. Cody's getting a string of wins here. Santana beat Austin Gunn with some shenanigans probably. And Miro defeats Brody Lee in the main. Britt Baker feigned an attempt to walk out of her match against her rival. Maki Ito chased after her, only to be struck with an unexpected sucker punch. Playing right into her opponent's hands to take advantage of her frustration, the Knight's encounter will force her rival to fight more cautiously from now on. That damn Britt Baker. Tensions between Santana and Austin Gunn have grown out of control. The two superstars fighting with each other before the match can even start. Damn, Austin Gunn looks good. John Moxley beat Kenny Omega. Okay, maybe that'll push him down the division a little more. Britt Baker beat Maki Ito. Proud and Powerful beat the Tag Team Champions, the Young Bucks. Okay. Team Taz beats Men of the Year. Christian Cage beat Adam Page, the world champion, and he's the number one contender, so that's pretty big. Lance Archer beat Andrade, and Miro beat Brody Lee. Champion Maki Ito got revenge against Britt Baker with a furious assault. Colton and Austin have taken the rivalry to a personal level after attack. So Ortiz and Santana got attacked by the gun club and still beat the Young Bucks. All right, let's see what we got here. Adam Page versus Christian Cage. Christian Cage beats the world champion again. We might have a new world champion at All Out. All right, we have Maki Ito and Britt Baker. Can they coexist against Riho and Hikaru Shida? The answer is yes. <laughs> 
Britt Baker wins. Forehead. Pen Rio. Oh, wow. Andrade versus Lance Archer. Lance Archer wins. Team Taz versus Wardlow and MJF. Team Taz. Oh, and of course, they pin Wardlow. Now, who will Joey Janela call out on this show? He calls out Cody. Joey Janela called out Cody and beat him in a promo battle. I wonder if Cody used the word pontificate in this promo. Probably. Probably why he lost. Ortiz and Santana versus the Gun Club. Colton Gun pins Ortiz. I'm telling you. I'm telling you, man. All right, let's see if Luther can uh, win the TNT title here. Look at the big dog. Are they going to tie up? Wow, they tied up and Miro sends Luther back, but he gets right back up to his feet. And Spine Buster, this is going to be a match. True. Miro in full control here as he gets Luther up. What's he going to do here? Alabama Slimma off the ropes. Miro coming back at Luther. Goes for the Judas effect. You know Chris Jericho is one of his friends. Oh, the main event Spinebuster puts the end of the dream on that one. Fireman's carry. Stun gun off the ropes. Oh, and he caught Miro right in the neck bone. Miro on the ropes. Is he going to hit him with the same gimmick? Uh-oh, nope. He's going to get him off the bottom. <laughs> to the outside. Luther trying to start a beat down of his own. Miro fights back, tries to throw a kick. Luther sends him to the floor. Hit with a single leg Boston grab. Yeah, Maki Ito style. Bear hug? Wow. Wow, Miro with the bear hug. He wants Big Loot to stand up. I think he's got a kick coming right for him, and he does! Luther to the mat! Ooh, this could be it. It's a two count and three. Miro shutting down the Luther dreams. Miro retaining his TNT championship. Has to be the most dominating TNT champion so far in this universe by far. Still hasn't lost it. Still hasn't lost. Miro's kind of just a beast. <laughs> Britt Baker and Makito clash in their tag match, trying to one-up each other instead of working together. Well, I guess it worked because they ended up winning anyways. Motivated by frustration, Joey Janela caught out the superstar who had been putting him on the losing end recently. Cody answered in a tense verbal exchange, saying the word pontificate over and over for some reason on the mic. It seems a decisive match between these two rivals could be imminent in the coming weeks. Kenny Omega has defeated John Moxley. Adam Page has defeated Orange Cassidy. Cole Cabana beat Miro. Okay. Cody beats Joey Janela, of course. Britt Baker beats Vaney. Lance Archer defeats Christian Cage. Ooh, number one contender gets beat. And Proud and Powerful defeated the Gun Club. Colton Gunn tried giving his rival a taste of his own medicine by blind tagging himself in the match, but Austin Gunn responded with attack and left him in the ring? Colton Gunn tried giving his rival a taste of his own medicine by blind tagging himself into the tag match, but Austin Gunn responded with an attack and left him alone in the ring. The Gun Club has exploded. What? <laughs> what am I looking at? This is the craziest timeline ever. Power rankings, Austin and Colton Gunn are one and two. AEW All Out. Powerhouse Hobbs will face Miro for his TNT Championship. Now, this is a big match right here. Powerhouse Hobbs had a hell of a performance in the Casino Battle Royale, finally getting his shot at the TNT title. Joey Janela versus Brian Cage. We have the Gun Club versus Proud and Powerful. Kenny Omega versus John Moxley versus Orange Cassidy in a triple threat. Britt Baker versus Maki Ito running it back one more time. Andrade versus Lance Archer. And Christian Cage versus Adam Page for the AEW World's Championship. Uh, who is for Amy Sakura? Let's put Amy Sakura triple threat in this match and just see what happens. Because I don't want to run Britt versus... Britt versus Ito three pay-per-views in a row. I, I want to change that up, so I'm going to change this up. All right, we have made a last-second change. Britt Baker versus Amy Sakura versus Maki Ito for the Women's World Championship in a TLC match. Amy Sakura getting the chance of a lifetime here. She scored a big win here in the upcoming weeks coming all out. She moved up. She's the number two contender right behind Britt Baker. Now she's being thrown inside the match here in this triple threat. Now let's get AEW All Out started. Miro and Powerhouse Hobbs, and he goes right to town. Ah, see, this is the move right here. This is how you take somebody down. Yeah, I don't know what's up with these MJF 2020 signs. Get these some bitches out of here. Goes for the line. Oh, spin kick from Powerhouse Hobbs, who throws a line, and now he's in it. Ooh, go to the press. Is he going to go for the 10 in the corner? The crowd's getting behind him. 
Does he get the whole Monty? And he does. Miro throws a line and there goes Hobbs to the floor. Goes for the chop. Miro just straight up blocks it. Here we go. Throws a punch. Goes for the big kick. Doesn't connect. Hobbs. Oh, with the knee. Got rich. Oh, and he hits it on Miro. Does he go for the pin? No, he doesn't. He doesn't follow with a pin on that. Somewhere JR is in disgust. Oh, but he does go for the pin. Down for the pin, just a one. What does he got planned here? Doesn't matter what he's got planned. You get punched in the face. Hobbs with the spear! Will he get the three on Miro and become the new champion? And Miro kicks out at just two. Powerhouse Hobbs is looking to end this match. Will he be able to do what no one's been able to do just yet? He's got him up. Running power slam! Is that enough to put away Miro? TNT champion down for the count. And Powerhouse Hobbs has defeated Miro at AEW All Out. And we have a new TNT champion. A huge win here from Powerhouse Hobbs. Getting his due. Rusev, you son of a bitch. You're going back to the Fed. <laughs> He was a spy all along. All right, we have Joey Janela versus Brian Cage. Brian Cage ends up getting the win. We have Proud and Powerful versus The Gun Club, the last match of their long feud. And Proud and Powerful in the end does go over. We have Kenny Omega, John Moxley, and Orange Cassidy in a triple threat. And Kenny Omega pinned John Moxley. Now we have the triple threat TLC match for the AEW Women's World Championship. Britt Baker, Amy Sakura, and Maki Ito. You can see the ladder as Maki Ito goes straight for Britt Baker. Amy Sakura could not care less about these two's little rivalry. Should we go get the ladder? Look how big the ladder is compared to them. Oh my God. I don't think I've ever done a, a TLC women's match on this game. Britt's got Amy Sakura in the corner. Is she going to hit? Hit the superplex? Makito said, y'all do whatever you want. I, for one, am not going to do any of that. If she hits this ladder, I swear to God. Maki on the ladder. Oh, my God! Wow! Superplex knocked him all straight to hell. Britt Baker now setting the chair up in the corner. And Makito head first in the steel chair. Thank God. And it doesn't matter because her head is made of steel. Britt Baker rolled out and you both left Amy Sakura in the ring by herself. Interesting strategy here, as she will simply climb the ladder now and try to grab the championship. She's got her hands on it. Britt Baker's got to get back in the ring and stop Amy Sakura. We could have a new World's Women's Champion right now. She's climbing up to stop her. Oh, she gets it at the last second, but Makito's in the ring now. Oh, and Britt Baker takes a big fall. Amy Sakura, hands on the championship. Makito's just got to stop her. She's just got to stop her. Amy Sakura seconds away from walking out of this with the championship. Seconds away. Maki Ito. Oh, she gets her down. Oh, my God. No way. No way. Power bomb stops Amy Sakura. She's out of the ring. All that leaves is the champion in the ring right now. If she goes to that table. Oh, barely missing the table. Maki Ito, the champion, climbs. She's got her hands on the title. Britt Baker sees her. She can't do anything to stop her. Maki Ito, Maki Ito, Maki Ito. And just stops her. Back and forth on top of the ladder. Maki Ito's looking a little woozy poozy. Britt Baker looks on with disgust. You make me sick. What is Amy Soccer going to do? She might knock down both of them, who knows? They're still fighting back and forth. And Amy Sakura says, okay, I think we've all had enough of this. She's gonna try to knock them down and she does! Both of them go down in a blaze of glory. Up to her feet. Tiger Driver coming up from Amy Sakura. No, she goes backbreaker style. Maki is on the outside. She can't stop her. Britt Baker's on the ground. Amy Sakura right now has her hands on the World's Women's Championship. She came into this match out of nowhere, and she might escape with that championship in hand. Maki Ito and Britt Baker, they do nothing in the new AEW World's Women's Champion, Amy Sakura. The feud was between Britt Baker and Maki Ito. Well, you had to remember there was one more in here, and it was Amy Sakura. Look at her with the championship. I can't believe it. She's done the fucking deal. The main event of AEW All Out. Cage meets Paige in a rage at AEW All Out. We actually started off with a tie-up. 
<laughs> little wrist lock action. Okay, we're going to get ourselves a little wrestling match here. We got a little reset. If Christian came down to this ring with a ring jacket on, I couldn't even tell you. It'd be an automatic win. Whoa! Off the ropes goes Adam Page. Oh, he's up on the shoulders. Might be looking for that stun gun. We've seen it once. We're going to see it again. Woo! Into the corner again. Does he want to do a drop kick again? He goes for it one more time. Hangman Page gets out of it and drops him with a huge boot. Jesus. Hangman sending Christian into the corner. He's going to give the people what they want. And what they want is the full 10. Will he get it? And he does. Hangman getting Christian to his feet. Oh. Tombstone Powell Driver, center of the ring. That's rough. Uh oh. Does he want that dead eye? What's he thinking? What's he thinking? I think he is. Oh, no. He's going B-Driver, and he hits it clean and flush, and Christian Cage might be losing this one right now, but no, the two. Oh, my God. Please tell me he does the WWE 12 diving headbutt, man. I'm begging you. I'm calling you out right now. Oh, frog splash. Down for the count. Just a two. I think that's supposed to be the Deadeye animation. I don't know if the Deadeye is actually in this game. I think it is, but maybe not. Christian stalking him. Does he want that on prettier? Turns him around. The world's champion goes down center of the ring. It only takes one. It only takes one. Is that enough? Oh, <laughs> no. I thought that was it. Christian drops a line. He drops two lines. Off the ropes. Tilt a world backbreaker from Christian. Is he going to go to the top rope? No, he doesn't. What is Christian's signature? Well, it doesn't matter because Adam Page is not going to let him hit it regardless. Goes for a kick. Oh, he steps over and we got some blood. Adam Page is bleeding. He goes for the big lariat. Christian Cage moves out of the way. This is what you want to see. He's always desperation mode. The blood is getting to his head. Desperation mode, Adam Page. Tosses Christian off the ropes. Goes for the rolling elbow and misses. Christian drops him with a forearm. All it takes. He's lining it up. He's looking with his eyes. Christian Cage. No, he missed. But no, he got him. On prettier on Adam Page. Is this enough to put him away? He's bleeding. There's blood everywhere. And Christian Cage is your new AEW World Champion. Yeah, we get to see Christian Cage with the belt. The AEW World Champion right here. Christian Cage. Man, every single championship changed hands tonight at All Out. That's crazy.